Did anyone listen? Did anyone wonder why? I stand by and I watch man's inhumanity to man. No, my children. You will not go through the great tribulation. Those that can trust me, but this does not mean that you will not taste the tribulation of man. Man's inhumanity to man. Man that is power hungry and greedy and evil to the core that wants to write, write righteousness off the face of the earth that wants to wipe my son Yahshua's name off the face of the earth since the beginning of time there's been a war and it is Satan that wars against all that is holy his time's coming, but until that time, all flesh will be tried. You already have been tested. How many of you been in a fiery furnace? In many various ways. And before the cloud of witnesses, you still kept your love and faith. As the evil grow more evil, and the women breed with the demons. And his soulless ones come forth, full of an evil. You cannot even begin to comprehend, for they will have no consciousness. No concept of right or wrong. No love for anything or anyone. You call this a clone, but it is not a clone, for a clone would have to be a duplicate of me, and you cannot duplicate, for you are not a creator. It is Satan that is an imitator through these clones. You think when you eat cloned meat, you are nourishing your body. But how can that be when there was no life in that meat? You eat damnation to your own body. I prophesy to this handmaiden that water would be rationed years ago and now you see it to come to pass in places it's never been rationed before temperatures are soaring in countries that's never soared before the earth is shaking in places that's never shook before I'm angry but not at those who can hear my voice I am angry 
that those who refuse to hear, for hell was not created for a human, not even the lake of fire was created for a human, I sent a redeemer, my own son, to keep you out of these places, I gave my son, for I love you so much, I redeemed what the first Adam had done, and yet how many of you are hell bent? How many are you afraid to witness to your families? How many of you live in houses unequally yoked? With a spouse that hates my very name? With a spouse that hates all that is holy? And yet they say, I am doing this for Yahweh and Yahshua's name. You do not honor me. In fact, you dishonor me. For Jacob I loved and Esau I hated. Oh, how I want to shout this. Should you not hate those that hate and despise all that is holy? Should you not hate those that blaspheme in my Holy Spirit? What fellowship? Does Yeshua have with Belial? With Beelzebub? What fellowship can lightness have with darkness? Yet you insist on staying in these marriages. That are not a marriage in my eyes. It is a bondage that I despise. For I I never join them together. And yet you think you've done me a favor. And all you've done is grieve my soul. As the children are raised in heathen homes. And I've told you a house divided cannot stand. And the spouse cries out to me. Deliver me. Oh, if they only would have listened all along. If only they would have realized I divided long ago. So now, my children, get ready. I remind you, you are your brother's keeper. For those of you who have cared, when you're seeing your brother or sister go in lack, just remember that I have taken notes. And someone else will be raised up when you are in lack. For those of you that close your eyes and ears, so our brothers or sisters cry, just remember this. Your very cries one day and prayers I will despise. You have been tested. And I know those who have passed the test. 